Okay. If I stay here, I'm going to focus. So I'm just going to close that monitor because if I don't close it, I'm going to spend my time looking straight at the monitor instead of looking straight at the lens. So what I, I want to talk about today is like my strategy to approach client. And I want to be honest right away because um, I'm not an expert on that. And what I'm about to do is just very, uh, it, it's a trial and I don't know if it's going to bring any real result in the long term. I hope because I'm going to spend quite a bit of time doing it. I'm going to spend a lot of time doing it. Like the next week or two are going to be dedicated to almost only that. The strategy is pretty simple. So basically what I'm about to do is I'm going to put my money where my mouth is and I'm going to use video to like reach out to clients, to potential clients. Okay, I'm uh, I'm really, I'm really sorry, y'all. That guy really was uh, a complete idiot. Um, I'm going to do a video about all I'm blabbering about in that video. So um, it's coming. Sorry about that. Ciao, bye. I don't know them because as I, I said a couple of times, I just moved here and I'm starting from scratch. So I think it's kind of a fun experiment because you're going to see me try something that may fail, but just to like give a little bit of context, I've used that technique um, before. It's not the first time I'm do that, but it's the first time I'm going to do it the way I'm about to do it. The first time I kind of started implementing this technique, it didn't give me like huge result because I didn't do it the right way. And I think it's kind of like part of the fun of being in business is like you do something, you have small results and you're like, why do I have those results? And then you go back and analyze what you did and you look at how other people do it and like all of that. And then you realize that you didn't exactly do it the right way. And it's, it's fun. I really tried hard to find this first video that I used to send to people. Um, I don't know where it is. It kind of got lost, but it was basically just me talking about myself. And that is the big mistake. Like it was a generic video that I recorded once where I just sat and said like, hey, I am this person. I do this. I'm good. Me, 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 me. It was always about me which is never good, which is never a good thing. Because when you approach someone and you want to make do business with them, it, it, it really should never be about you. And what I mean by that is that you approach them to give them a service. You approach them because you see a fit between you and them. And in a way I kind of personally see business is I have something to bring you and the two of us together is going to put you in a better place than you were before. My skill set is very beneficial for you. So here's how I can make you make more money. Here's how I can help you grow. And that's kind of what I discovered because every time you trade your money, you trade it for something and it has to be the same way in business. And especially when you work in filmmaking as I do or, or graphic design or anything like that, you have to bring something to the table. And now what I'm about to do is exactly that. I'm going to use this old tactic that I used to use, which kind of work. I got a couple jobs from that and people were like, oh, that's cool. That's the first time I get like somebody sends me a video like to pitch and whatever. And I'm like, oh, cool. But now what I'm going to do is I'm going to record one video per person I'm trying to reach out to. So basically what that means is I'm going to find the right person because in a business, there is always somebody who you want to talk to. And that's kind of like one of the, the other mistake I used to do. What I used to do is that I would find the generic email like info at and I would send my video there. And what probably happen is that I'll probably just end up in a trash. And now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to find out who in this business is in charge of marketing, like head of marketing, or I don't know if this is going to work. Probably. I, I have a good feeling about that. And um, I'm going to report to you like in a couple months after I publish that video 
and I'm gonna tell you the result. This is going to be interesting, I think. So we're, um, I wouldn't say a month later, like two weeks later, a week later. Um, you know, my beard is a little bit scruffy, but I've been busy. Um, it, it kind of started working, so uh, doesn't really take all that long, but it's nothing very perfectly set. But all I've been talking about is kind of bearing fruit already, so maybe there's something to it. Okay, ciao. I'm gonna keep tab on everything. I'm going to keep tab on everything. And I'm going to do that for a lot of um, aspect of my business. So please subscribe. Um, turn on the notification bell, I think. And you're going to have, uh, you're, you're going to be able to see something. Maybe, I hope. Right? If, uh, if it fails, if I fail miserably, um, you're going to be, that guy's an idiot. Let me not listen to him. If I, if, if it works, you're going to be like, oh, not so dumb, that little man. And, uh, yeah. So please subscribe and, uh, leave me a comment, please. Because comments really help. I really like it when people leave comments. It's fine. Let's, let's shut. Bye bye. You're beautiful. You're an amazing person. You know that? Have a nice day. You scallywag. Hello, beautiful people of the internet. YouTube Space 2.0. Oh, boy. Yep.